Okay, so today I'm going to spend just a couple of minutes um, talking about something that a lot of people have been asking me lots of questions about on the uh, on the stream, as well as uh, you know sending me emails and private messages and and even asking me in game. And that's how do I make um, a very large amount of gold in Diablo without actually spending any money or without botting or without doing any of that uh, shady stuff. And uh, I know I've explained it a couple of times in stream. I know I've mentioned it um, a few times, but um, uh, the way that I make uh, my money in Diablo is actually pretty simple, um, and it doesn't actually involve farming. It doesn't involve uh, doing any of anything really in game that you would think it does. Because if you spend all day farming legendaries, um, you know you're you're looking at making maybe maybe 200 million gold a day, which is a sizable amount of gold. But if you compare that to the value of 200 million uh, gold and in a real money, you're looking at, you know, gold at $28 a billion, you're looking at like $5.60, and then Blizzard takes their 30% cut, so you're looking at about 4 bucks, um, and that's assuming that you farm all day in Diablo. Uh, how I make my money in Diablo actually involves um, a, a lot of trading, a lot of cross-game trading. Um, what I actually do is I've been playing lots of other games um, in, the past, uh, in the past few months and in the past few years, and how I make... Uh, a lot of gold in Diablo is I actually use different tools and uh, different resources to trade currency from other games to gold in Diablo. Um, so what that means is I, you know, I have a whole bunch of currency. Let's just say, you know, we're gonna just say this is this isn't the game that I played. We'll just use it as an example. Let's just say you have a whole bunch of gold in World of Warcraft. You don't play World of Warcraft anymore, and you know a way to make a lot of gold in World of Warcraft per hour. Um, what I do is I use different different tools, uh, different resources to to trade the gold from World of Warcraft into Diablo Gold. Um, and there's no way to actually convert, you know, gold from uh, from from World of Warcraft to Diablo. You know, there's no direct conversion. So what you need to do is you need to find people who want World of Warcraft gold and have Diablo gold and who are willing to trade. Uh, one of the best resources for doing this is a website called D2JSP, which uh, just popped up right there. Again, I don't work for D2JSP. I don't get paid to promote their website or anything like that. Um, the only reason why I mention it is because it's helped me a lot um, in the past couple of months. It's helped me make a lot of gold, so um, in turn, I want to help you guys make make some gold, and, and that's why I'm kind of... Uh, kind of uh, showing it here. So uh, one of the games that I've been playing, I don't actually, I don't think it's a very good idea to uh, to actually uh, say it in this video because it could have an impact on the market, but um, it's, it's, it's one of these games and other games. So you can go to, um, you can go to any game, let's just see, I've never even heard of some of these games. Let's just go to Terra, and again, I've never played Terra. But what you do is if you, you know, if you've played Terra, if you if you have a lot of money in that game, um, what you would do is you'd look for someone on this website who who wants to pay you the mediation currency that is used on D2JSP, which is called Forum Gold, um, and then you trade that Forum Gold for Diablo Gold. So here's people selling ISO IGG. So I want to get uh, the most gold I can for my whole Forum Gold. So this guy has a 1,100 Forum Gold, and he wants to buy a lot of uh, a lot of money in um, in uh, in in Terra. Um, so he's willing to spend that 1,100 forum gold. And if you guys have, you know, gold in Terra, which again, a game I've never played, a game I don't really know much about, just to, just as an example, um, you know, this guy's looking for money. And then let's just say you were to get that 1,000 forum gold. Now we'd go back to the main main page here, and we would go to uh, the Diablo section, Diablo 3 Softcore America's Trading, and we go to FT, which is for trade. And let's see, in-game gold. Here it is. This is the post that I saw earlier. All right, this guy here, he's got 13 billion gold in Diablo, um, and he's trading uh, two, uh, let's see, one million Diablo gold for two form gold, which means he's trading one billion Diablo gold for 2,000 form gold. So we have 1,000, which means uh, we could get 500 million gold off of this guy. And uh, again, you use this mediation currency called Forum Gold. And again, you don't have to use this website. This is a very, very convenient way to... Um, very convenient way to trade currencies from one game to the other, but I'm sure you know you can do it any way you want. If you just have people that you know, um, you know Skype, you know if you have friends on Skype or you know Facebook or whatever social media you use, as long as you have someone who's willing to trade you currency in one game to the other, you can make a lot of money um, in Diablo, and that's how I actually managed to make a couple of billion gold a day. Is I just have so much money in these other games, and I'm just so active uh, trading. I'm so active selling it, buying and trading money um, 
that uh, I, I managed to make a lot of gold in Diablo. Um, so I know it could be a little bit tricky if you've never really done this kind of kind of thing before, but you can think of all game economies as, as, as real economies. Like Diablo Gold, you can think of it as a very large economy, because it is a large economy. It's like, you know, the US dollar, the euro, and then you can think of, uh, you know, other games as much smaller economies. You know, the currencies that you don't really hear about that often. And because they're all online, they're all kind of interconnected. And if you have one currency with a little bit of work, you can actually trade it uh, for another currency. Um, it just takes a little bit of work, and uh, you kind of have to, you know, you have to have some connections, or you have to use a, a website like D2JSP. But um, if you know what you're doing, if you if you have a lot of currency in other games, you can actually make several billion Diablo gold a day, which is more than you would make. Um, it's more than you would make. Uh, you know, farming or doing any of that stuff. So, um, hopefully that answered a couple of questions. Hopefully you guys, uh, uh, hopefully some people watch this video. Hopefully a couple of your questions are answered on how I make so much gold in Diablo. And um, that's pretty much it. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please don't forget to check out the Twitch live stream uh, that I stream pretty much every day. Twitch.tv slash GoodIdeaGaming. Um, and then uh, make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel if you guys enjoyed the video. It would really be awesome. And also, um, if you can see at the bottom left hand part of the screen has uh, has my Twitch and then Twitter, twitter.com slash goodideagaming. If you guys really enjoy the content, if you guys really want to help support, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to YouTube, checking out the live stream and, and uh, following the Twitter. I think that's what it's called, following the Twitter. That would be awesome. So thanks again, guys, and uh, hopefully this helped out. So I'll see you soon. Peace.